Hey, what is up guys? Today we are back with yet another Animal Crossing full update video. I can't believe it either. There is still so, so much content that people are discovering and finding out. And one that Nintendo kind of mentioned was of course the body paint and eye colours. And I mean, I myself was a bit perplexed. There's nothing in these cabinets. Where am I going to get them? How do I access them? And I mean, I play Animal Crossing quite a bit, uh, as you guys have probably seen from my channel. Now, you don't need a freezer to do this, but the freezer will become clear. But I'm going to show you guys how to get them and how to access them. Something Nintendo completely missed out on actually telling us. At least I haven't seen anything on it, but I've seen some people make some very, very cool stuff. So we are just going to find out how to do it, unlock it and access it and hopefully show you guys how to use it and what you can actually expect if it's actually worth your knock miles and that is of course your next clue so you've got to go over to the knock stop and of course get your daily knock miles if you haven't already done so and then hopefully you guys have enough of these because they are very pricey so i mean you can get a fence for a thousand which is pretty cool you know you can get a knock miles ticket for two thousand but here, you have the body paint costume tips and exploring new eye colours at 2.4k each. So you are, of course, going to need 4.8 thousand miles. And you know, if you've not got that yet, you can travel to people's island and, of course, rack up your knock miles that way. Or, if you are a time traveller, you can skip ahead a day and just keep rinsing and repeating and getting the bonus knock miles. It will take a little bit of time. And there you'll see it mentioned the vanity or mirror that we'll of course need. And I mean, I'm still annoyed you can't multiple buy things. So you can't just like select a few and buy. You have to do them each one by one. I promise you I'm not dragging out the video. You guys will literally have to spend like 30, 40 seconds getting these items, getting them printed out and having your character tell you they can now learn them. Even though we put it away and we got it back out. So, yeah, very strange. But we've learned about new eye colour options. I bet I could change up my look with a vanity or a mirror. And as you guys probably know, you know, when you're getting ready in the morning, you look in your freezer and you can change, you know, your appearance. You can change your outfit, your face, your eye colour, your makeup. All gets done by a freezer. Logical, I know. So we are going to go to our new little area. Which is, of course, just to show off for a video. And if you guys want to check that out, I will have it linked down below. Or as an iCard. So, if you're on, like, a PC or a phone, I think they still pop up there. Click the iCard, check it out, and come back to this video. And you can see how to unlock all of these crazy items. And even get some of the very cool recipes. But, let's get our brand new freezer out. Hopefully it works, or we will have to return it. And, of course, we are going to go into it. And there's a lot of stuff in there. But we are, of course, going to get changed. Okay, so you guys may have probably saw me start that bit. And were like, oh, what's he doing? You can't change there. Much to my surprise, you cannot actually do all of the stuff I said in a freezer. Uh, which, quite frankly, I'm devastated at. Uh, I even took off my helmet and put it back on. And I could not access anything. So, apparently, no, guys, you can't get changed or do your makeup in a freezer. That is Rayroon's fun tip. Um, and if you are like me, Rayroon, and did not know that, uh, that's my kitchen. Why am I going that way? But if you are like me and didn't know that, then now you do, and you are very, very, very welcome. But, luckily, we do have a multitude of mirrors in here, actually. Well, we have two. But, you know, that's good enough. But... We can change up our look with this full length wooden mirror. So let's do that. And there we have it. We've actually got access to painting our face and our hands. Yeah, you do You do a full face paint job on this. I mean, he even blends it into his hair. He, he is serious about this. But you can, of course, change your face color. And, you know, have like a ghoulish green or a spooky spooky white i mean what would you use a white for i guess like zombies or creatures without a lot of blood would be super pale or a vampire that'd be pretty cool uh, a blue one you can be Papa smurf i mean who doesn't love that 
That's a great idea. Uh, purple, you can not be the people from Avatar, which I was going to say, because they are also blue. So you can be a Smurf or an Avatar character. Um, pur- what what would be purple? That's let me know. Let me know what the different colours can be used for, and I'll have to give something. Uh, from the spooky sets that I showed off in the last video to someone who comments the best ideas. But uh, I'd say for this, we're going to go a ghoulish green. Uh, you can, of course, change your hair. So, I mean, should we do like a full makeover for this? Let's do some bedraggled zombie hair. Uh, I mean, that that kind of looks the part. I mean, we look way too happy. Uh, we're going to have to look kind of tired and drowsy here. Um... I mean, we could be a kawaii zombie, but we're not going to do that. Uh, and I've seen some people do some very cool ones, so I might do a video going over these. Uh, and just going over the best ones. I, don't, I think those eyes work. Oh, I don't know. Nah, we, we look too happy to be a zombie there. There, I think those. It's a shame you can't change the eyelid colour. You know, you girls out there doing your eyeshadow and all that magic. You'd be, you'd be so annoyed at this. Uh, you could change your cheeks, so, you know, you don't want rosy cheeks if you're a zombie, of course. That'd be crazy. Uh, you can, of course, do actual face paint, which is very, very cool. But we kind of glossed over it. Here, you can change to a number of eye colours now. So, I mean, the green works, but we've got, of course, the standard blues and that. And, of course, we go to the funky ones, like the pink. We've got an orange there. We've got, oh, gosh, that's very creeper. That, oh, God, that, I don't like that at all. We've got the uh, the purple contact colour there. We've got the sort of silvery blue. I mean, th they look kind of kind of similar to that to me, just lighter. Then you've, of course, got the, the deep green blue. So let's, uh, let's wrap up with one of these. Oh, let's go for the one I don't like. You know, I'll try not to look at it. Oh, thank goodness it's under that helmet. But we'll go outside, we'll go back to our spooky furniture, which if you haven't seen the video, you should definitely check out. And I, of course, also want to see your guys' creations, so make sure you message me on Instagram, Twitter, Discord, or heck, if I'm streaming on Twitch, which will be linked down below as well. You know, if I'm not giving away stuff and I'm visiting people, or maybe giving away stuff for cool islands, we could do like a costume contest as well. So definitely stay tuned to the channel, whether we do that on Twitch or offline. Hopefully you guys can see that and help me judge. And um, we'll get like a few hundred Nook Mile tickets for the winner. That'd be very cool. But let's give a spooky, spooky reveal here. So let's of course not deal with the freezer again. But take off our face. And there we go. There is our spooky zombie in a magic robe with the messed up hair. And you know, not looking, not looking too well at all. I mean, I, this carriage should probably run me down if it saw a zombie like that in front of it. But thankfully, we can we can only drag it. You can't actually drive it, which is a real shame. But anyway, guys, that is it for today's video. I hope this helped you out, and I hope you've, of course, got your new body paint and new eye colours all ready to go for Halloween. Like I said, make sure you show me the best ones on all of my social medias down below, or show me while I'm playing live over on twitch.tv forward slash rayrune. But that is it for today's video. Thank you so, so much for watching. Until next time, peace out, take care, and as always, stay safe.